Hey guys, we're back here with uh, Mutashone. This is. Ooh, this has gotta be one of my favorite games by now. I'm really, really enjoying it. It's just so, like, good and relaxing, and I just. Oh boy. Alright, so. Oop, oh, oh, oh no. There we go. <laughs> okay. There, how are you feeling now? Like a new man. Although still an old one. <laughs> you look so vigorous. Now there's a word no one ever says about young people. Ha! <laughs> huh. I feel like... What would Spike say? A million bucks. And do you know what? I think I'm going to pay my old friend Yoke a visit. That's so good. Uh, so, oh my god, I just love all these characters so much. Like, when this game is over, I'm gonna be so sad. <laughs> Stinky salts and oils, okay. Chapter 4, Bath Day. Yes. Okay, so let's see what we got going on. Aelin said to get some seeds from Mori. Okay, I can do that. Oh, hey! Oh, I just wanna... Hi! Now then, one of the side effects of this regrettable loss of visual acuity is that my auditory powers are greater. I could hardly believe my ears. But did Nono make it out of his house this morning? Yeah. That is truly wondrous. I tried to get out the time to <coughs> see for myself, but I simply could not move quick enough. <laughs> In that case, I'm determined. I will stay here until he emerges. You'll forgive me if I leave your garden research for a later, for a little later today. I'm sure he won't want to go home without seeing you too. It has been too long, too long. Do you have anything else to say? Perhaps I should have smartened up too. I cannot let Nono outdo me. <laughs> oh. Oh, I love all these guys. I just oh, I just love them. Oh, wait, there's something I can pick up there. What do I get? Grab to Sure. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's fair. Bless me, I guess. Um, hey, hi, I just, I, I want to say hi. Okay, she's waving at me over here. I'll come say hi to you. Hey, I'm nearly ready to open if you're after anything. Sorry? Um, I nearly finished stock checking if there's anything you need for the bar today or... Hmm. I'm sorry, I'm such an early bird, I forget it takes a while for others to wake up. You haven't even swum yet. Or had any coffee. <coughs> and you go to bed so late too, I'm sorry. Just cause I'm not fit to answer don't mean I'm, I don't like to listen. You say sorry too much anyhow. <laughs> I thought she was about to say sorry. Aha! Despite all your perkiness, you don't know what to say now, do you? I don't apologize. That's the spirit. Here we go. Oh my. Okay. Uh, sure. I'm not sure I wanted to see you, um, butt naked, but... I'm sorry. <laughs> Aww. Hey! Hello? Oh. Can't speak to you. That's fine. I need to find Mori. Um... Spikes bar. Nope. Hey. Hello. Hey, what's up? Up is the sky. Maybe some birds and... I mean, <laughs> what are you doing? At lunchtime, I'm going to fish with friends. So I'm practice fishing now. So I can be good. Good point. Lunchtime is friend time. Now it's practice. 
That's fair. I can I can understand that. Hey, Mori. Hey, Mori. Hey. Um. Oh, that's how you get down here. Okay, that's fair. Hmm. Oh. Thank you. For giving me a new melody. That's cool. Ask about the song. Oh? That was one of the old songs. From before even my living memory. They're like folk melodies, I suppose you'd say. I don't know. That one always seems to come out when things feel on edge. But enough of that. How's Nano today? <coughs> he went to the bathhouse. My goodness. Well, how wonderful. Ask about the Kuroka seats. Actually, I need to go some Kuroka. For Aelin's wonderful bath oils, no doubt. It doesn't grow in my garden, but I'm sure I've got some seats in my store. I need to finish up here, but just you come back at lunchtime and I'll dig them out. In the meantime, why don't you go keep Tongue company? <coughs> He's messing around with that boat again. Sure can do. I'll see you later, sweetie. Okay. <laughs> that means leave. Oh, wait, wait. There was something there I could get. Oh, oh, I didn't get it. Why? Excuse me. Rose reed seed. Okay. Boop. Um, no luck. Need to go back at lunch. I'm 90% sure Mori's trying to set me up with tongue. Also heard another one of those songs. At least I think I did. Maybe I inherited being able to understand them or something? Guess I'll go see what tongue's up to in the yard. Yes. Yes, I will do that. Let's go. Oh. Maybe. This away. Oh. Tongue. Hey. Hey, buddy. Oh, hey. You're painting already? <coughs> yep. Fixed the holes. Sanded it down. This paint has some kind of sealant in it Dennis gave me. Um. It's a great color. I'm glad you think so. I don't know if they go. Anyway. Taking shape, right? Mm. <coughs> Better than moving boxes around anyway. Mm. Mew always said if I ever got my act together on this, we should take it for a test ride. Uh, actually, I was thinking tomorrow. <gasps> yes! Just a short trip or whatever. Would you like to come? Yes, yes, yes! Oh. Ah, I'm split between showing excitement and making sure that Mew is okay. <coughs> we'll go with that. Of course not. We're not. She and I are just. Please come. It would be nice. Sure? Where should I be when? We should leave at dawn from the harbor. I know it's early, but the currents are still stillest then. Mm. It's going to be really great, just you wait. Hang out a bit longer. Mm. Mom and Mori are worried I'm going to sail away in this thing. Why don't you? It's definitely not uh, open sea worthy. <laughs> Do you want to, though? My dad. I don't know. Maybe they think I inherited running away. Hmm. There's not much for me here, but why would there be anything anywhere else? Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Talk about dad. You know, my dad died a couple years ago. Hmm. He was a pilot. There was an accident or whatever. Maybe it was different because I was older, but it was just me and my mom and this tiny baby, you know? 
being left behind sucks. Dennis said I need to be more positive. He said fixing things always makes him feel useful. I guess I do have a pretty cool boat now. <laughs> That's right, you do have a pretty cool boat. I wish I had a boat. <coughs> okay. Let's see. Boat! Trip! Boat! Trip! <laughs> Will Def regret saying yes when I have to get up at dawn, though? Oh. Maury set to collect seeds from her at lunch. Okay. I can do that. Oh, wait. There's something I can grab. Wild grass seed. Um. Oh my god, I keep forgetting how to get out of here. Oops. There we go. Yikes. Oh, hey, you're smiling a lot. Can I talk to you? I just want to say hi. Let's say what's up. Kai, I went to see Alan about fitting me in today, and I couldn't believe it. You must be so happy. Be silly. Did Grandpa tell you I got scared by a tiny bug or something this morning? Because it was the size of an actual horse. Goodness. No wonder the bathhouse was your first thought. Now, uh, what... What was it I wanted to... Oh, yes. Ellen said you're going to fix up that sad bit of land by the lighthouse. I've got some seeds in my stocks that might help. <gasps> Yay! Oh my god! So many, thank you. Actually, the spotted conga is really rare. You might like to save that one for a garden a bit more central. Fair enough. Ellen can fit me in until this afternoon. I can't wait. I've been feeling really drab recently. Of course, it's probably all in my head. I'm sure I just look as strap as I ever did. <laughs> Aw, honey, you look fine. I think I'm gonna get one of Elin's face masks, and then go for a nice refreshing drink in the bar this evening. <coughs> Fair enough. Oh, they're all fishing, yay! Hey, guys. Hey, hey. I don't know if any- if y'all are really- are ready for this yarn. Will the yarn catch the fishes? A yarn's like a word for a story. Will the story catch the fishes? Unlikely. Come on, it's unlikely either way. And this is a special one. Special is good. Go on then. I don't know if you're ready for it. <laughs> Just tell us. The story, the story. <laughs> Alright now. Remember when Nono used to lead those meditation sessions? He'd get you nice and relaxed, guide you through your troubles. Well, once I was sitting here after a little meditative journey, feeling light as a feather. <laughs> I was looking at the water's surface, feeling woozy in a nice kind of way. Everything was all... All... All light and relaxed, but also completely clear, you know? Staring at the reeds, dancing away. Then, suddenly, under the surface of the water, Redder, much redder than any reed could be. Hair, beautiful red hair. Oh, shut up. <laughs> I swear, that's what I saw. Someone cut off their hair. <laughs> beautiful green eyes. No, dummy. Spike's saying he saw a mermaid. Not a dummy. Just for a second. And in the flick of a tail, she'd gone. Shouldn't call people dummy. Just a perfect moment. It was just some red seaweed and a fish or something. Hmm. It felt totally real. Real! It was real! <laughs> Look what you did to Bo Pick. Just because you're too sad to see mermaids. Shut up, Bo. Come on, guys. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> oh. <coughs> Look, I was just trying to liven things up a little. Sure. <laughs> Oh. Friend fishing was supposed to be fun. It is, buddy. Look, beautiful sun in the cool water. See any redheads down there? <laughs> Yikes. Okay, I'll just go get those seeds now. Bye, guys. <laughs> Hope you figure it out. Hey. There you are. I was actually a little inspired when you came to ask me about seeds. Some are quite rare, but I've got whole sacks of the green claw. They're too bitter for us to eat, but when I was scrubbing out my pan this morning, I thought all this fat could be thrown just 
I thought, all this fat just being thrown away. And then it hit me. Seed balls. Handy little feeders for the birds. <coughs> cool. Got to care for the creatures as well as the people. But enough of my yapping. Here's what you came for. Nice. Nice. So m many seeds. I'm rushed off my feet today. I've not had a chance to even breathe. Have I missed anything good? Let's talk about the bathhouse. Um, Nona got clean, I guess? It's so incredible what you've done for him, you know? I can't believe it. Although I have to say it's very rude of him to not drop by. <laughs> Aw, be kind. I'm sure he can't wait to say hi. He just had to get clean first. I'll have to finish up lunch here, but soon as I have a moment, I'll go out and find them. Are you okay? Of course, it's just... I'm the youngest of the lot of us, you know? Not by much, mind. Always the third wheel, and I liked it that way. Those two thickest thieves, always finding new things uh, to sulk about. And I'd be there to soothe the pride and laugh at the folly. Oh, ignore me. Chopping onions always gets me. Oh, honey. Are you hungry, sweetie? Want to hear what's for lunch? Yes. Yeah. Wonderful. Veggie or meat first? Veggie. Today's veggie special is wall sprout stew. Very high in vitamins. But to be honest, no one ever seems to want wall sprout stew. <laughs> it's a little bitter, but in a good way. Want to hear about the meat? Yes. Maybe tell me about the meat. <laughs> Nose hog and jalosa leaf stir fry with noodles today. I recommend crispy blue bugs as topping. So, can I make you something? The stew. Lovely. Just a tick. Yay! Here you are. If you see Nona, tell him to wait for me to come out and say hello. I will. Oof, these onions are really stinging my eyes. Okay. I'll take that as a hint to go. Um, so we got the seeds, let's see. Got a bunch of cool seeds. Apparently the garden out west by the lighthouse is best for Kuroko. Aelin wants some Kuroko so she can make some bath potion with it. Okay. Out west by the lighthouse. Let's go there. Plant some Kuroko and get some Aelin. That's the plan. Let's go. Is that a turkey over there? On the dock. <laughs> oh, oh. Stone leak seed. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Sweet. Here we are. Oh, wait. Um. Wait. How do I? I had the thing for the garden, like, oh, there we go. <laughs> Plant seeds. Kuroka, Kuroka, Kuroka. Nope. There we go. I want it here, and here, and here. Uh, beach garden needs more varied harsh plants. Okay. Wait, what was the one that I should plant somewhere else? That was uh, one of the ones I only had one of. Kaluka? No. No. The Kunga. Yeah. Okay, hold on. So we got this. I can plant this. There we go. Coral weed. Yeah. 
And there you go. Gnome mushroom? Yes. I'll take it. There we go. Grab to pella the Uh-huh. Can I fit one more here? No. There we go. Oh, there's more. I have more. There we go. Stone flower. Yes. <coughs> Stone grass. Hello. There we go. And... Let's see what else we got. Red adder. I'll take it. Put it in the corner so I can fit some more stuff. There we go. Is that all we got? That's harsh. Wait, no. I think that's it. I think that's all we got. Yep. Okay. Growth songs. This one. Oh! Composed harsh. Nice. Play it some more. I love this. Play it some more. Oh! Again. Or are they full grown? I think they're full grown. Okay. Ten plants. Kuroka, Kuroka. Wait, you're Kuroka, right? Can now be harvested. Harvest. That can't be harvested yet. Okay. Needs more space to grow. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Let's move you then over here. This plant is doing well here. Nice. Okay. Well, I got what I came for. Um, this garden made me feel all jangly. That's a weird thing to say, isn't it? Good job I'm only writing it down. Okay. So, Aelin needs Kuroka. We got that. So, let's go see her. And drop off the Kuroka. Oops, whoops, oops. That's not creepy at all, that smile, buddy. <laughs> Christ. Oh, there's something I could grab. Grab. Pratia seeds. Alright, wait, there's more I could grab. Borobora. 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 Oh! Hey! Hey, guys! I'm sorry to keep saying this, but it's such a joy! Such a joy! You haven't got rid of me yet. But it is good to see you, old friend. I so wish to visit. But with all those steps, I know, don't think on it, chum. But now I'm back at ground level. 
How about a rematch? I'm sorry? Chess. I've been dying for a game. Can you get time away from that infernal archive of yours? You know, I've always time to beat you at chess. Oh. This chess set has been gathering dust. I thought I might <coughs> be able to tempt Jelly to learn a scientific mind like theirs. But alas. How have you survived without me to keep your mind lively? I did an I did attempt to set up a small book club. But only Claire was interested. We don't quite <coughs> agree when it comes to literature. If I recall, she likes adventure and crime. I tried to persuade her of some of the greatest the great romances, but she just didn't seem interested. Come on now, let me get one last victory before I shovel off this mortal coil. <laughs> oh no. Oh, that's how I'm to keep you hanging on in perpetual defeat. Oh, you okay? Indeed, indeed. Oh, I love these guys. Well, now, aren't you supposed to be going Kuroko for Aelin? Excuse me? You work, too, you work that girl too hard, you know. Not that she hasn't done a world of good. I didn't tell you about uh, our little visitor this morning, did I? Don't you believe a word he says, Yoki? Worry not. I've always taken everything Nona says with a pinch of salt. I love these guys. These guys. Hey, the sausages. So why are we here? Market research. I just wanted some fresh air. But why does it have to be me? <coughs> why does what have to be you? Go on. Human girl. Good start, very polite. <laughs> We'd like to talk to you about this exfoliating qualities of mud. Leave now while you still have a chance. <laughs> I'll do that. I'll go drop off my Kuroka. I suppose it could be too much too soon, but Kai, how's the gardening? Sorry to interrupt. No worries. Ah, you've got the Kuroka, I can smell it. Lovely woody scent. Yay! Thank you. I'm run off my feet until this evening, but I'd love to take a look at the garden. Why don't you meet me out by the lighthouse this evening? Show me your hard work. Yay! Of course. You're such a star. I'll see you later. Yay! I'm so glad that I can help. Nothing too much, I just want to feel fresher. Any particular plants? Just so I know what we're aiming. I might go to the bar tonight? Lovely! We don't often see you there. Well, I like to have tongue come space. I like to leave tongue some space, you know. Grab's back tomorrow, right? Hmm. Have you worked out what you're gonna- No, I don't know. The thoughts- The thought make makes me sick. I thought I wanted a father for my kid, but I don't want to disappear in the process. When Gorn left, I felt like I was drowning. Tung was the only reason I hung on. But after a while, I realized I'd been so sad for so long before that. I wish I'd seen it like you have. Come on now, we've got to talk about something cheerier. Um, I'm reading a really good crime novel at the moment. <laughs> oh. Fair enough, I'll leave you alone. So what are we what are we doing? Uh what are we doing? Uh wait. Kuroka is super sticky. Smells nice and woody though. I guess I can see why it makes a nice nice bath oil. Try and not forget to show Aelin in the garden this evening. Yes. Should check in with Mew about this boat trip. Wonder how grandpa's reunion with Yoke is going. Let's check in with Mew. She lives out here. Right by the archive, I think. Is she here? Hello, Mew. Is she maybe out by the swim spot? Bearweed seed, nice. Oh, Piccolino seed. She wouldn't be out there by the. Oh no, she lives. Yeah, yeah. She used to live by the archive. That's right. I... Mm, yes. The thinky smarts. I got them. 
Um, going. She lives like up by our garden. I'll talk to you guys later. I gotta check on Mew. Whoops. Hey. Guy. Oh man, I made a decision. Claire's coming to the bar tonight. It's perfect. You gotta come. Don't ask me why now. Just come tonight. It's gonna be incredible. Like a movie. I just gotta copy a tape. Okay. <laughs> Rad. I'll need to borrow his tape deck. But I'm sure I can get on the boat without him seeing hun seeing. Hunter's feet gotta be good for something. Yeah, this is gonna be great. Make sure you come along this evening. I will. I wanna ask you about the boat. Oh, Tung said you're coming on the boat trip tomorrow. That's cool. Hopefully after tonight we'll have something juicy to talk about. Oh, wait. I think I get what she likes, the romance of these now. Okay. Okay, so she's fine with me coming on the book trip. Let's see what we got. Um, you is 100% stoked about doing something in the bar tonight. Need to go along if I if only to discover what. Okay, let's go see Grandpa. Oh, there's something I can grab. Jalosa seed. Nice. Hey, guys. Hmm. Take all the time you want. I know exactly what you're gonna do. <laughs> I won't be distracted by your smack talk. I can't believe it. Mighty fine sight. Out and about after all this time. I'm old, not deaf, Mori. <laughs> it's a miracle. As much as I love a bit of... Hyperbole. I'm trying to concentrate. It's a real tonic to see you boys reunited. Honestly, I didn't die. And while I appreciate your kind welcome, all I want right now is for my friend Yoke here to finally make the move I know he's going to make. There. Go on, say it. Okay, that was unexpected. <laughs> yes. Oh. That's so cute. Uh, Yoke seems uh, so stoked to see him again. Quite sweet, really. That's good. Need to show Il in the lighthouse garden. And then I should tell Grandpa about the lighthouse garden. We'll show Il. Oh, hey. Dear girl, so nice of you to say hello. I've had such a whirlwind of, of a day. Almost like old times, you know? Although it has meant that I've somewhat neglected our uh, research. Who won? Would you believe it? A stalemate. In fact, I suspect I could have found a way out of it, but old Nono was looking a little tired. And I didn't want to push him too hard on his first day out and about. But as to the research, I was able to unearth a copy of a poem that isn't too different from the one you recited for me. Seven Gardens, so there is a secret. Seven Gardens, Muda Sung, Papu Flowers for the Fung. Well, it seems like it might be connected to some carvings Manny left in the sample. Can't go out there myself, but I found a rubbing of them in some old manuscripts. What did they say? They involve what I think must be a code. I can't imagine Manny would wish to keep anything from us, except for the sake of safety. Anyhow, I think it's a simple rot cipher. I just need a little time to translate it. Drop by the archive tomorrow. I should have more then. We got so many things to do tomorrow. Christ almighty. Okay. <coughs> but for now, go into the lighthouse. To the lighthouse. I love the artwork of this. I love it. I love this game. I just love it so much. Hey! Where is she? Oh, there she is. I thought you wanted to see my garden. 
You've had a busy day. Oh, I know. I had to sit down. My feet were aching too much. The garden is a delight. It's almost like it changes the sound of sitting here. Recently, when I've looked out to sea, it's felt like there's bleakness ahead of me and scrubland behind. But now it feels full and rich at my back. I'm glad to help. I'm sorry, I meant to invite you out here to show you how beautiful it is at sunset. Do you come here a lot? It's my favorite thinking spot. How's Nono after his bath? Be honest. You know, just himself, but cleaner. <laughs> if I'm honest, he's annoying me a bit at the moment. He keeps on saying mysterious things, and I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I just wish he'd be straight with me, you know? Ah. Nono was always a little frustrating. Don't get me wrong, we all love him. He thinks he's lost the scientist thing, but you can still feel a little bug under a microscope. You should just ask him to be straight with you. That's what I'm gonna do. With Grop. You gonna be straight with him? He gets back tomorrow. I'm terrified if I'm honest. He was so excited about the baby. I don't get it. Oh, love. I have to tell someone. I have to practice telling someone. I'm sorry, you just... You're like a fresh pair of ears. It's okay, just say it. I don't think the baby's grubs. Oh, no. I'm almost certain. It's tongues. What? Grubby decided we should live on the mainland. He was away so much and I was lonely and confused and tongue was just always there to listen. I always thought of him as a kid, you know, but then there's one time one night by the fire he put his arm around me. You know, like people say took me in his arms? Suddenly I realized this kid was not a kid. He's man-sized. Bigger than man-sized, really. And the things he said, they were just perfect. Like he'd been listening to me this whole time. It was just once. He understood. I think he understood. And when I realized, well, I told him that was why we could never work, because the baby was scrubs. I don't even know if he knows how many months it takes or whatever. I'm awful. It's awful. Can you imagine I'm saying something here which is, like, the right thing to say? Huh. Okay, it is awful. But I said it. I can tell him. Both of them. You telling Grub tomorrow? That's what I've decided. I don't know how anyone is going to react. But the truth is the important thing. Oh god, I should let you get on. I wanted to say thank you for the garden. But now I suppose thank you for everything. It's been so lonely. You've made me feel less alone. Oh. I want to talk more. You should go and relax after all the hard work you've done today. Mia was saying she's got something planned in the bar later. <sighs> okay. I'll go tell Grandpa about the garden. Wait. Oh. My. God. Aelin's baby is tongues? This is unreal. And I'm supposed to hang out with him tomorrow and not say anything? Yeah, I know. Girl. I know. Honestly, I am also shooketh. I... My god. I'm at a loss for words. I am shooketh to the choreth. Let's go see Grandpa. Maybe he have something to say. Have I mentioned, Kai, how pleasant it is to have a fresh young face about the place? You're welcome. I wish I had a less peculiar way to express the sentiment. But your energy. A welcome change of perspective. Hard though it may be to believe, Nona and I were young and full of energy once. Make a joke. Always running around the place energetically adding things to books. Especially gathering information for the encyclopedia. Sunny days, punting our little floating lab through the swamp light. We would spend hours cataloging. 
I would sketch samples and Nona would make notes about where they liked to grow. Whole seasons would pass in that happy, quiet way. Glorious days. Wait, you have more to say. I want to hear. Hmm. I try not to dwell on the past, but sometimes it's nice to visit just for a short holiday. You're right, my good man. Let's go see Grandpa. Oh, you're back in bed. Hello. Aha. There you are. The Wanderer returns. You've been the one wandering today. Indeed. I've been out in the daylight. I'm the cleanest I've been for weeks. I was able to see my dear friend Yoke, and I let him think the beat... I let him think he beat me at chess. We have a lot to be grateful for. Not least the new life you've brought into the world. The garden by the lighthouse was a success then. Talk about the garden. Um, yeah, I guess. I grew it. It felt, I don't know, it felt different to the other, others again. All jangly and tense. What is that pose? And look, I still want to know why you think it's a good thing for me to do. What it is I'm supposed to be learning. Well, careful you aren't being swayed by the energy of the day. You see, dear girl, why do you have to speak in riddles all the time? I'm not here just to be some gardener or whatever. What are you here for, then? Escalate. To see if you really were wor worth running away from. Oh, no! Why did I just say that? And your conclusion? <sighs> Today I saw some dots in the square. I'm sure my friend the dot shaman sent them down to check on me. I thought I was feeling better. But after today's exertions, I find myself a little lightheaded. Wait, no, did I? I'm not in the mood to speak with you further. I suggest you go out and clear your head. Did I? I didn't mean to... I just wanted answers. I didn't mean to hurt him. Lost my temper. I'm awful. Everything is awful. Said I'd call mom today. I could really do with talking her to talking to her at TBH. Okay, fair enough. Let's go talk to her. I've been a little asshole. Uh, can I get this way? Yes, I can. Good. Uh, wait, no. I need to go in the bar. I didn't mean to be mean. I just wanted answers. I can't believe. Wait, no, I should talk to these guys. You're annoyed. Come on, Bo, let's just play. Don't want to play with Moody Tongue. I'm not moody. And if you lose, your moody mood will be double. Well, I won't lose then. Fair. Fair enough. Yay! No. Oh dear. A second round. Come on. But I want to say the I want to stay the winner, and not get you angrier. Just play, okay? I'll leave you to it. Call. No, that's not. I didn't. I didn't mean. <laughs> I just want to call my mom. Pick up. Mom. Mom. Kai, honey, is that you? Hi, Mom. I'm so glad you remembered to call. How are things going? They're definitely going. <laughs> what have you been up to? Talk about people. Everyone stops staring at me like I'm an alien now. A small community like that, there's going to be a lot of gossip. I don't remember much, but I remember how warm it felt. Claire and I used to explore, run all over the place, get into all kinds of scrapes. But there was always someone to pick us back up, keep an eye on us. 
I could do with a whole village to watch Toby. Anyway, I'm so glad we're finding a place there. I'm so glad you're finding a place there. How's your grandfather? Let's talk about that tension. I don't know. I mean, he's definitely healthier. But I don't know how a grandpa's meant to be. Our grandpa's supposed to be kind of bossy and use a bunch of words you don't understand all the time. Well, I think it's quite possible that that's how your grandfather is supposed to be. Hon honestly, sweetie. It sounds like you're making a real difference. I'm so proud of you. Uh, yeah. But it's all... Oh, did I mention your brother learned a new word today? Stop it. <laughs> well, it sounds more like top it. I must be shouting a lot. We really miss you, honey. I miss you, too. What? What's sticky? Stop shouting sticky. Sorry, sweetie. I should probably find out what's sticky. Oh, I'll talk to you the Sunday, okay? Bye, love. Wait, Mom, I need to... Nope. Nope. She's gone. Oh. <sighs> oh. But I just needed to I just needed her to listen to me for a moment, but there's always some stupid bigger mess that my stupid brother caused to deal with. Mew said I should go to the bar this evening to see something cool. I am at the bar. Nope, that's not. I wanna talk to these guys first. Hey, does anyone wanna talk to me? Nope, nope, nobody wants it. I guess I'll just Oh, what's this? I've not heard it before. The lyrics are especially good. Listen. Kind words, soft spoken. You begin and end my days. Mew! Mew, you didn't! Shh! Such a lovely melody. I see strength behind your sadness. See heat in life and love. Speck wrote it. It's really good. Stop it. Stop it right now. Mew! <laughs> Christ, what's wrong? Mew, no, no! Oh, Claire? Ooh! Is the song for Claire? The song is for you. Spike loves you. Claire, please. I have to go. Oh, no! Oh, Christ! Why did you run out? What did I do wrong? Nothing. It's a great song. When I raised you, what did I do wrong? When did I teach you that it was okay to cross a boundary like that? I just wanted to get out. What? Get out. Spike, it's just that I ain't repeating myself. Everyone out. Aww. Hey, hi, buddy. Not now, Jitterbug. Okay. <sighs> what an asshole. Spike loves Claire. Yes, couple of the century. Nice to have some good news. Although I guess Claire didn't look so stoked. I should go see if Claire is okay. Yes, I should. Claire, hey, hey, Claire. <laughs> Claire? It was a beautiful song. I don't think Mew meant to upset anyone. I never, I, I never, I'm sorry. I'm a bit useless right now. Need time. Need to, I wish I could make an inventory of all these feelings. Don't worry about me, please. I came here because stock taking helps me relax. I'm where I want to be. <sighs> Wait, what do we have to say about that? I need to see. Maybe Mew did a stupid thing. Clara looked totally broken. Oh. 
I just... Uh, that was an awful thing to do. Let's go. Oh, hey guys. Hey, 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 hello. You feeling tired, old man? <laughs> Somehow both energized and exhausted at the same time. <coughs> good. Good. That's a good way to be. Let's go to bed. Okay. Oh. What's going on? Um. Oh. Why am I the phone operator? All of a sudden. What? Excuse me? What is this? Kai? Kai, is that you? Wait, what? Ex excuse me? Me- I knew you wouldn't wake up in time. Come on, boat trip. Harbor, now. Alright, okay. <laughs> boat trip, boat trip. Um, that day was too much. Yes, it was. I'm gonna leave that there. That was a very interesting day. Um, a lot of things came out that I did not see coming. Um, but yeah, next time we'll go on the boat trip and then there's a whole bunch of things that we needed to do today that I have all forgotten by now by realizing everything that's going on. Um, but yeah, I'm really into this game. I, I can't, I can't get enough of it. So, all right.